Hey, what's up, everybody? Greetings from sunny and warm Florida, my new kitchen. How do you like it? Top of the line. It's been a minute. Haven't done one of these in a while. A lot of shit's happened. Um, you know, my brother passed away in October from uh, a long battle with an addiction. And I'm going to open up with this. Because I'm writing a book on addiction and to have him pass away um, in the middle of all that was, uh, it was deep. And I did what I, what I do. And that is to channel all of that into my writing. I grieved, I cried. Uh, and then within three, four hours, I was on my computer putting that shit into the new book. So, if you're struggling with drugs or alcohol, get help. Get help. Don't be embarrassed. Everybody is fighting fucking demons, man. That, that's what life is about. But you don't try to go it alone. One stick could be broken easily. Remember that. So, that being said, I'm making a, a wonderful uh, lentil loaf. Tonight, and uh, what am I, what are we serving it with? Fucking um, mashed sweet potatoes with uh, cashew cream and uh, steamed broccoli. And I took the liberty of, of preparing all this stuff already. So I mashed up the lentils that's cooked in vegetable stock. Everything's going in here. Apples, walnuts. Carrots, celery, zucchini, you got rolled oats, organic, everything's fucking organic. Do I, do I gotta fucking tell you that by now? Stay the fuck away from the pesticides, man. Don't eat that shit. And now they're doing some crazy shit with the food. Uh, so... You know, I'm down here in Florida. We're going to be growing our own organic vegetables and stuff like that. So avoid that shit, you know. Forgot to tell you, roasted walnuts. Um, and then we do a, a glaze on top with organic ketchup, organic barbecue sauce. We do the veggies in the spices with a little bit of olive oil. Um, and that's about it. So... We're gonna put all this together. I'm gonna show you what it looks like cooking. Show you what it looks like plated. Fucking bears over there. Look at this guy. <laughs> He's just fucking waiting. <laughs> What's up, bear? That's the bear. He loves it here too. And uh, that's what's up. Putting in the work, putting in the training. I got uh, Iron Man. Chattanooga coming up end of September. November, I'm going back to get my redemption in Florida. And uh, just down here training, man, doing the grind, doing the writing, all of that. So uh, anyway, we'll keep this short and sweet to the point. I'm going to fucking cook this shit down. I'm going to show you what it looks like after it comes out of the oven plated. I got some friends coming over tonight. Absolutely love it here in Florida. We're in farm country out here, high springs. And uh, that's about it, man. Get back to you in a minute. I got to go with the handheld for this. So you got the apples, the fennel, the sage, the salt, the pepper, carrots, apples. What else we got? Zucchini. It's all cooking down. So we're going to cook this down. We're going to mix that with the lentils and the rest of the stuff. And then we're going to plate it after it's cooked. All right. So uh, here's what we got. All the mixtures in here. And uh, I put a little olive oil so it doesn't stick. Look at that. Bear smells it too. So uh, this is going in. You preheat your oven at 350. Right? Let this go. Then we're gonna do the um, the glaze that goes on top, which is next level. 
gives it a little more flavoring. When this all cooked down with the fennel and the sage and the asphatida and the, the turmeric and the cumin, unbelievable, smells great. So stay tuned. Uh, this goes in the oven, it comes out, we put the glaze on, bada bing, bada fucking boom, and it's done. Stay tuned. Everything about cooking is fucking patience. That's why I love it. It's like meditation. And after a while, I've been doing this 40, what? 42 fucking years cooking this way, right? So after a while, you learn how to do shit in stages, right? Look, in the oven is the loaf. We got the cashews, which I soaked overnight. And that's going to be for the cashew cream that's going in those sweet potatoes. So we're going to have the, uh, the lentil loaf, the cream, cashew cream, sweet potatoes. And we're also going to have the uh, steamed broccoli spears. Also wanted to mention this. Boom. We worked hard on this. Through the whole shit that was going down, blood clot. Came out on Upstate Records. Uh, you know, you could grab the record if you want. Get some good tracks on there. And here comes the bear. What are you smelling? What are you smelling? He's smelling something. He's like, I can smell something's cooking. <laughs> anyway. You know, it's all about having fun too. You put good vibes into the food. Don't cook if you're fucking angry. You know, if you're hangry, I just uh, went to the gym, did a good hour workout of HIT. High intensity interval training. I think that's the right words, right? Might have the order scrambled there. High intensity interval training. One hour with my boy Chris. And, uh, and now I'm just making this, uh, this dinner. So uh, stay tuned, it's gonna be done. I'm gonna show you what it looks like plated, and uh, and then we're gonna eat the fuck out of it. And it's high protein, right? Because of the lentils, it's also got some carbs in there because we use the uh, the oats. So there's oats in there too. All right. So and once again, I'm gonna post the recipe on this when it's done, so you know exactly uh, what the fuck to do. Right? There's no guesswork. You take the guesswork out of it. And, uh, it, you know, we have to eat healthy, man. That, that's what's up. We got to eat healthy. We got to live right. If we learned anything in the last three years, it's that. Take care of your body. Take care of your immune system. Take care of your mind. Right? What the fuck you got going on? Don't be stressed all the time. Right? Stress produces the stress hormone cortisol. I was telling my friend that today. You know, it's going to make you gain weight. You're not going to sleep good. All this stuff. You need sleep. You need recovery. All of this. It all goes hand in hand. But you have to eat clean and you have to eat good. You know, one of the things that I'm doing now is, is to not cook any more fake meat. Um, whether it's, I never liked that impossible shit anyway, you know, your boy, uh, you know, B, BG is invested in that. It's genetically modified. I don't fuck with it. You know, I messed with, um, the, uh, Beyond Meat. I don't fuck with that no more either. The most I'll do now is Satan, which is the, uh, protein of the wheat. That's all I'll do. I don't do any of this other shit. With all these oils and all this shit in there, man. That's my thing now, is I'm eating a lot cleaner. I'm staying healthy. I'm staying lean. You know, there's no weight to lose. I, I, I'm like 168 right now. So I got to, I'm going to shred up about three pounds before, before my, my uh, race weight. But it's about consistency. Stay consistent and eat good constantly, man. I'm going to show you how to make this cashew cream in a minute. The potatoes are going. Uh, and then, uh, that's about it. All right. Stay positive. Keep the PMA. It's all mindset, baby. And there you have it. The finished product. We got the lentil loaf. 
right? Protein carbs, protein carbs, glycogen, sweet potatoes with cashew cream, and what do we got there? Some steamed broccoli. And look who the fuck is waiting. Look who's waiting over there. It's the bear. <laughs> that motherfucker loves some broccoli. All right? There you go. I'm going to post the recipe. Um, and that's what's up. Peace out.